today I'm going to try a GCSE high tier maths question. So the question is A, B, and C are points on a circle of radius 5 centimeter and center O. DA and DC are tangents to the circle and DO is equal to 9 centimeter. So Work out the length of arc A, A, B, C, and give your answer correct to three significant figures. So, first, we need to know that a tangent and radius meet at right angles. So, angle O, A, D. is equal to 90 degrees and DO is equal to 9 centimeter AO is equal to 5 centimeter okay so, we can now use trigonometry to find the angle A, O, D. So, cos of angle A, O, D equals to adjacent, which is this one, over hypotenuse which is this one. The adjacent is 5 centimeter and the hypotenuse is 9 centimeter. So angle AOD equals to cos inverse 5 over 9. So cos inverse 5 over 9 is cos inverse 0 0.556. So cos inverse 0 0.556 is 56.22 degrees. Okay. Then in triangle a O D and C O D right angle hypotenuse and one side are same. So triangle A O D is congruent to triangle COD because of RHS. So, angle AOD is equal to angle COD. Therefore, angle AOC is equal to 2 times of angle AOD. So, angle AOC equals to 2 times of 56.22, which is angle AOD. And 2 times 56.22 is... 112.44 So the angle of sector ABC which is this one is equal to 360 minus 112.44, which is angle AOC.
So 360 minus 112.44 is equal to 247.56. Okay. So <clears throat> by using the arc length formula, I will get the length of arc a b c which is equal to angle of sector a b c over 360 degrees times 2 times pi times r so the radius is 5 centimeter here. Okay? So that equals to 247.56 over 360 times 2 times pi times 5. So, that equals to 0 0.6876 times 2 times pi times 5. So, finally, 0 0.6876 times 2 times pi times 5 is equal to 21.6. 21.6015. So the question asked me to give my answer correct to three significant figures. So 21.6015 rounded to three significant figures is 21.6 centimeters. So, that's it for this video. Bye!